Welcome back to Funny and Cute Caricatures. I am artist Marta Setniewski and today I will be happy to show you how I color and draw uh, Belle, Princess Belle from Beauty and the Beast. She's a beautiful smart princess and with the face of Kaylee Rogers. Let's get started. First I draw the shape of the head. Beautiful round at the top over here. Going toward the sides like this and the other side the same going down toward the chin just a little bit square with the indentation here very good and then we go up to the smile he's so cute corners of the mouth dimples lower lip Let's draw a line for the lower lip upper lip like this and then we go up to the nose a longer part here and then sides one and two perfect go up here to the corners of the eyes and the eyes will be somewhere here and here and they're beautiful round go up here down toward a wing up here down toward a wing, reinforce up the eyeliner. Draw another line for the upper lip, lid, eyelid. Here you go, and the same on the other side. Then we can draw the inside of the eyes, iris, and then maybe a few dots to indicate the eyelashes, lower lashes upper lashes like this <laughs> so cute and then the eyebrows the eyebrows from here and are pretty straight and lower here like this and the same on the other side goes over here and a little down here perfect now let's move up to the hair Oh, which is about here going to the side in a section like this and a little bit more at the top and on the other side it's going over here and then it goes down at the ears it goes down to beautiful curls beautiful curls going here oh, what a pretty princess and the other side and then the neck and then we look at the drawing uh, the shoulders go like this the other one is more of the torso this way it's gonna go to here Maybe like so. and here it will continue with the dress here this arm will be holding a book this way the book is lays on this hand um, somewhere like this Connect it and then repeat this shape the other side. Add some pages underneath and on this side. Uh, indicate the hand over here and over here. Yellow gloves. Okay. And then let's make it. Oh, like this. Then we have this shoulder sleeve like that going towards stones in the middle and repeating on the other side perfect and now let's go down to the dress the dress is like this over here and it is tight with decoration over here and let's do the same on this side Like 
this and then beautiful jewelry here that ties the decoration on the dress a little bit more detail and then the dress continues this one continues over here going this way and going this way and over here like that perfect and there will be some undergarments on this side beautiful and then she could be standing on some floor here Let's add more curls and let's go in with color. Yeah, I think that's perfect. Let me just reinforce this fold of the dress over here and over here. Okay, perfect. We get a flesh tone, skin tone, um, soft pastel. Go over this part, put the picture closer. This is so cute. So little. Looks a little bit tired. Oh, here we go. On the sides of the nose, the cute little cheeks. Going up here, under the chin, under the neck, arms, and blend. Let's add some pink for the lips. Mm, this one. And a little bit on top of the nose, on the cheeks, on to the side. Like this, on the lips. We can add some here on the forehead for balance. And blend. I will use a dark pink uh, pencil pen, pastel pencil to add some details on the lips. And on the cheeks. Okay, then I will use a brown pencil to draw the eyebrows and add shadows here on the bridge of the nose, on top of the upper, on the eyelid, and here it goes toward the sides, like this. Then going down the sides of the nose, there's a little cute bow, and we can blend it. To blend with more precision, you might uh, want to use a blending stamp instead of a finger. And here we need the bags under the eyes. And the same on the other side. And blend to make it look natural. And then we have the dimples, corners of the mouth, I'm not certain I like this shadow color, I don't, um, let's use a different brown then, how about this one, oh yeah this is a lot warmer, a lot more beautiful, that's a lot better. Beautiful. And blend. And this blends beautiful. Alright. It's a lot, a lot better, a lot more beautiful. Here we go. And here the cheeks. 
open puffs under the mouth, under the chin. You can add some shadow. Beautiful. All right, let's do the hair. Going with the same brown onto the hair. There we are. And the other side. Blend. Beautiful. I will use the same brown as the shadow for the dress. Over here, wherever you can have folds, there should be a little bit darker shadow. And over here. Okay, blend. So brown and yellow will look golden. And that's what I want for my drawing. She has blue eyes. Blue to the eyes. One dark blue on top. Dark blue on top. I want lights. Let's do yellow light. Make it more green. I will use a little bit of that yellow also for the highlight in the hair. Over here. And over here and on the beautiful curls it will be later covered with the outline color here on the shoulders we have light and the dress so the dress adding the yellow to the dress beautiful and to the lower part of the dress as well Very nice. Um, I will add orange, orange for the decoration and for the torso. And for the torso part of the dress, here we are, blended. Beautiful. Okay, I want more saturated yellow over here. That's what will make it pop out. Beautiful. Like this. And let's um add on the let's add the outline and then I will add the where's my outline color? Here is black outline all around. And then I will add the highlights after. So here I'm just reinforcing the hair, the black line. lightly here and there just to make like a light outline and the other side the same gently scaling and curly over here beautiful Okay, I want the um, edge of the face to be a little bit softer because I see here coming in the cheek more chubby than what I drew at the with the, with the outline a lot. Okay, like this and then here more flat. Okay, I also want to add a little bit more pink over here. And blend. And then, ah, uh, yeah, let's continue with the outline. Um, here we go, eyebrows. For the eyes, I want, um, we will use a, a pencil pastel so that it will be more precise and more friendly toward creating the eyelashes. Goes down here, drops down like this and we also a few lines for the eyelashes go on top and onto the eyeball repeat the same on the other side 
going up here and dropping down. There you go. Beautiful. We will reinforce the eyebrows. And go under the nose. And then the um, inside of the lips, the line, including the corners. Like this, under the lower lip. Under the chin. And use the kiwi. And then we uh, outline the dress. in the middle, the sleeves, here's the torso, into a shape and the book, and the other side, flat, outline the book as well, so she's a smart princess, she likes to read Go. And reading is wonderful. Okay. And there we have stones on the dress. I can use a little shadow here. Mm, for the shadow, I would use brown. Okay. So let's do the decoration here. The parts that are hanging. And we still gonna go in with the highlights, so it's not not all like here under we have some and um, how about we go a little bit um, let's go with the white. Let's go with the white highlight and yeah, and that will be it. Here we go on the eyes, here and on the opposite side. I'm going through the eyeball on the corners. She has a, a lot of light in the corner, in the middle of the nose, over here and on the bottom of the nose, over here. A little bit on the forehead, but I already left some white. We saved the white, so it's good over there. Then we have light going toward the side, to the corner here, corner here to the cheek. Beautiful. And then we have on top here. I will add blend. This blend is so they are not harsh lines, but only gentle transitions from night to dark. Oh, there we go. And then the chin. Beautiful, we can add more light on the hair. And over here. Turn this way. Beautiful. And on the neck. On the arms, highlight the white of the book, and on this side. And then when you work for a client, you can inscribe the book and write something that they would like inside the book. Then we go to dress. Like this. Highlight the highest points. Inside you can do this. And gently and there we have it all right thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed it please like share and subscribe